We are with Maren, a member of KMK Club, and he's going to explain us what they do in his club. Yes. Um, well, in KMK, we come together every Friday night. We are about 40 members. Uh, not everybody is there every week, but every every week there is a. I, would say 20 people or something we come together um, some people work on their models um, other people come and check them out we talk about them we show our models to each other finished but also when we're working on it so we can ask questions like how can I do this or how can I make that a little bit better or ah, how would you do this or uh, do you have some advice or some information and and we well, we talk a lot about it, we have some drinks, uh, good atmosphere, uh, and basically we, we share our passion together. Mm -hmm. And then while doing that, we're having fun and we're learning from each other. Uh -huh. um, and that's basically the entire idea behind the club. And of course, with the shows like we are at now, we go together with the people from the club, have a good time together, uh, put a stand to show our work to, to the other people at the show and then try to promote the hobby uh, like that too. Do you think that clubs are like a therapy for people? Yes, uh, certainly. The hobby itself is already like a therapy. It's a relaxation, something to take your mind away from everyday life and can get very passionate. And then to share this with other people is also very therapeutic, very relaxing and, and the other people they become your friends and, and many people in, in, in the club they are really best friends together and they also see each other outside of the modeling club. So yes, it's, it's really a, a very social thing. The hobby itself is a bit solitary because you're at home working on your models but being in a club makes uh, can make it a very very social uh, hobby i know you wrote a book for ak interactive can you tell us something about uh, yes of course um, it's a book in the diorama series and it doesn't focus on the techniques of how to make a tree or how to make the ground or things like that but it focuses on how to come up with an idea for it, how to tell a story, how to, how to develop that idea and that story and make it into one visual image, a model, and how to use the composition to on one side tell that story and on the other side make sure that it all looks good uh, together. So it's all about composition, planning, storytelling. <laughs> so I illustrated the ideas in the book with my own work but not only my own work, uh, also the work of 84 other modelers, some of the best modelers all from all over the world, because I want to have more variation and uh, more different subjects and uh, more inspiration also for the other modelers. So the book is both for people to, to learn a little bit more about storytelling and composition, but also to have inspiration about uh, diorama modeling. Thank you so much. Thank you for your time and good luck. Thank you very much. <laughs>